Fast in London, we have got one douche. Hello, guys. So, Michelle reminded me a moment ago, um, the last time we spoke, you you had planned a night in a pub with a lady on a piano doing versions of Warm (laughs) Douches set. Uh, We sounded amazing, but then I seem to remember that it got at least postponed. Did it ever happen? Never happened. Uh, Shout out to Magic Betty. I don't know where she's at, but she, she... I, I don't want to go too far into it, but she did hit me up and ask me to borrow. Uh, this is a true story. She had, she didn't do the gig, but then she like a couple of weeks later she asked to borrow Marley's keyboard. So, so I'm, I'm sure she's doing her thing. It's right. Fine. Okay. Right. Well, if it happens, then let us know. I can feel a dual session coming on there. Oh, I'd love to. Yeah, so she. I mean, she's a pub entertainer. Is she basically? Yeah. Yeah. She's. Um. She essentially does like show tunes but like then also common like pop songs and sings along to it um i think she's from hungary and she's about probably about 75 and she just has like tons of really good energy but um well you know when you said 75 because i had an idea that perhaps you could take her out on tour as the opening act and then you said she's got bundles of energy so that negated that so maybe maybe that's somewhere (laughs) down the line she might take my job (laughs) <laughs> right, okay. She, she'll turn up in a tracksuit, mate, with a load of bling and shades on. You'll be out the door before you know it. Yeah. So, um, your tour's been going really well, hasn't it? It's been going amazing. Right. Thanks. Oh, I'm going to give a shout. i got to remember this if I say it right. The Brahmies. First night in. Big right. ups to them on the bicycles and everywhere else. Really good vibes. Everyone's been coming out. Really good parties. And, uh, yeah. I mean, complain. that's the thing, isn't it, at the moment? If people do need cheering up, Lord knows. And so, um, yeah. you know, warm do sure are like the best night out, I, I reckon, completely. I need to be cheered up every single day. <laughs> right. so, okay, yeah. well, just call me, mate. I've got loads of jokes. Oh, thank you. Definitely. So, um, the tour continues tomorrow. So you're playing Reading, Sub 89 in the Bowery District, uh, District the 9th at uh, Gloucester Guild Hall, the 10th Norwich Waterfront. Then... You've got on uh, Friday, London, Electric, Brixton, which is not just your Common a Garden gig, is it? Not that any of your gigs are Common a Garden. No, we, it's, yeah, it's going to be an all-nighter um, until they make a stop, I guess. So, yeah, it starts off a bunch of live music. Well, it's, it's, it's live. It, it doesn't, like, switch very. It starts off with bands and goes into DJs and all kinds of things happening. And it's at Brixton Electric. And, yeah, they gave us the keys and... and uh, they're going to have to throw us out, basically. Right, OK. I mean, we've, I've talked about this on the programme before, but I'm more for the kind of matinees where, you know, it used to be for children matinees. Well, this is but... what you do back in the old days. Mm. You'd set your alarm. I mean, this is in the dance, a little more relaxed. So what you got to do is you set your alarm for maybe like three, have a little nap, and then come and join us. Oh, you know, that's far too organised for come me. Come I would, I would absolutely love to come and see you on Friday, but there's a, a, a myriad of reasons why I can't, but I hope to see you before too long anyway. I um, hope to see you too, and thanks, man. Yeah, no, an absolute pleasure, always. And so, um, you're going to do Burner to begin with. You're doing Burner, Hot Shot, and Twitching in the Kitchen for us, aren't you? That's right, it's exciting. It's the first time we've done Burner on uh, the radio. Shout out to Mr. Cool Keith. I was going to say, yeah, so Cool Keith, you know, when people say, I'm mad me, they're not mad, are they? You know, it's one of them things. And when you call yourself Cool Keith, is he cool? He's probably the cool. Well, in my head, anyways, he's the coolest MC there ever there ever was, or maybe not ever, but he's up there. There's okay. no, there's no you might, yeah, there might be better, or there might be as good, but there's no better, I'd say. Right. Okay. So if I start calling myself Cool Mark, you wouldn't go upset then. Uh, I might. And not might, re- yeah. Nah. Yeah, no, I wouldn't blame you. <laughs> yeah. I wouldn't blame you. <laughs> I wouldn't okay. do that. You know, I love you, you guys. You don't need to do that, Mark. <laughs> no, of course I don't. No, nobody would believe it. But, um, yeah, you know I love you guys, and um, I'm looking forward to this love you. very much. Love you, Mark. Okay. All right, and then we'll get to it. Please, warm douche, live from Maida Vale. Yeah.